Congratulations. 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 Congratulations, class of 2020. Congratulations, class of 2020. Congratulations, class of 2020. Congratulations, class of uh, 2020. Congratulations to all of you. And congratulations on graduating. Class of 2020, congratulations. Congratulations to the class of 2020. Congratulations, Intrapiz class of 2020. Hello, class of 2020. Congratulations. Congratulations, class of 2020. Congratulations to the class of 2020. Congratulations, class of 2020. So, to the Queen's Engineering Physics class of 2020, I raise my diet coat to you. Congratulations, Enchvis class of 2020. Congratulations on your graduation and for persevering in these difficult times. However, you should remember that a university is primarily a place where you learn how to learn and to make good decisions based on solid evidence. So as you proceed, continue to be curious, continue to learn, and continue to practice evidence-based decision-making. We are very proud to produce some of the top students in the country, if not the world. Today is June the 10th, 2020. So it's only fitting to remind you of what education is in the great words of Malcolm X. Education is the passport to the future, for tomorrow belongs to those who prepare for it today. Hey, class of 2020, you survived. Congratulations. Congratulations, class of 2020. Sorry we weren't able to give you a proper send off. And good luck as you take your newfound skills and your enthusiasm out into the world and do great things. I wish you all the best. It has been my privilege to be a part of your journey through the engineering physics program. I wish you all the best as you move on from here. I know that you will be successful along whatever path you follow, and I hope that you will stay in touch in the years ahead. I thought I would bike over and give you a glimpse, Sterling Hall, your home of the past four years. Undoubtedly, many of you would be right here today, taking pictures with your classmates and your families. And as others have mentioned, we invite you to come back to Sterling, close the path integral so that we can keep current and know that you are max well. How fast that will come, however, is perfectly uncertain, which means it's perfectly certain that we'll see you again here. All the best. Uh, from Archer and I, we want to wish you all the best. Uh, it was a pleasure teaching, um, teaching you all in three, four, five, and I hope I didn't scar you too badly. And I'm keeping Archer's attention here with a few snacks. And I'm sorry that I didn't get to say goodbye to most of you, uh, but hopefully um, you'll join us in the Zoom and we'll get a chance to say hello. You did it. Remember that your efforts have been integrated over four years and don't just reflect the last few months, which have been rather challenging for everybody. So good for you and use this time to think a little bit about where you're going. I'm sure you're doing that already, but listen to that still small voice within you because that will help you in your direction in knowing which is the way in which you will be most fulfilled and happiest in your life. When it is time, be very bold. Congratulations to the EngBiz class of 2020. I've made it no secret that you were my favorite class ever. Um, and there's lots of good reasons for that. I know you're all gonna be super successful in whatever you choose to do in the future. I hope you'll stay in touch with us um, in Sterling and I wish you all the best. I just wanted to say that I was uh, very fortunate to teach all of you. Uh, everybody who's graduating had to uh, take Quantum One with me a year and a half ago and now uh, you're the last students I ever taught that course to. So in a point of fact, you have a very special place in my uh, Heart and my history at Queen's and I hope my emotional goodbye was uh, uh, an indication of how special that term was to me. And so um, I just really sincerely want to say um, we're going to miss you. We hope we see you again. 
it's a huge amount of work and I hope you've gained uh, what we tried to give you, which is a broad experience in lots of physics, setting you up to go on and, and work and go on to graduate school and to contribute to Canada and to the world. And if there's one last uh, bit of advice I can give you, it's don't cut your own hair and don't grow a COVID beard. Take care. You've spent years uh, of hard work and you've honored us with that hard work in your time here at Queen's. <laughs> Now, uh, now that it's our time to honor you, uh, we have to do it like this. Um, it's, uh, it's been a difficult four years uh, for you, and it's a difficult time to be graduating. But I also think that for people who are like you, who have energy, who have passion, and who have skills, uh, there will be great opportunities for you to do wonderful things in our society. I hope based on your time here, you have been able to find your passion and that the knowledge and skills that you have acquired at Queen's, together with your tenacity, will play an important role in pursuing your passion going forward. A lot of excellent students have graduated from our program. And uh, yeah, I know a few of them. And uh, I'm very happy that you can all join me in saying that we are Queen's Engineering Physics grads. Yay! Class of 2020, I toast you. I salute you and I wish you all the best for your future endeavors. Cheers.